the course in grief is centered around training people who would a know the right health products that are needed for particular facilities they know the right quantities to buy know the right ways of handling them from the point of purchase to storage up to the point that the patient use them I have been in other universities and uh, I must definitely say that this was a completely different experience for me. This course really empowered me in the terms in, in the sense that it um, it taught me leadership and also the the site imperial sciences it really opened up my eyes that this can actually be happening in Kenya and not the sites and warehouses that we have been accustomed to before. I'm a finance officer and I found myself in a pharmaceutical environment. I needed to understand all of the ramifications of finance as it relates to supply chain. And when I came here, you know, it was like this was what I've always wanted to do and this was what I'm now doing. So it's like, Frank, you are in the right place at the right time and with the right people. The course is actually more than what I expected. I think. Um, it is actually a high level and a high notch than what I actually expected around here. And um, I never thought there could be universities like Strathmore, especially you know around in Africa compared to the public institutions. So I was actually you know surprised and at the same time excited to be to be here. One thing that uh, I was very much interested uh, about this training is that. Uh, uh, it's not only mainly focusing on pharmaceuticals, it also focuses on the human aspects, uh, the business process uh, from the operational management, the leader and the uh, manager. The structure of the course, it was structured in such a way that uh, it actually gave to me what I was looking for from my job site and I think because of the structure of the course I'm going to make a difference when I get back to Liberia. The content was very very spot on and of particular note is uh, the approach which is very practical uh, through the use of simulations, uh, exercises and uh, case studies that brings the, 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 the practical approach you know without being very academic. The main goal is to produce or to train people who are competent in handling health and pharmaceutical products. So uh, our training is actually competency based. We want people who are A, competent in sourcing the right medicine at the right time for the right conditions and making sure that those are available to everybody regardless of their ability to pay. Now that is not an academic issue, that is simply an issue of competency. We all had a good setup in terms of where we are coming from. We have common problems and the, the way we were solving, the way we were interacting, it was like each and everyone was uh, getting a, a input in each and every activity that, uh, that was happening. And it was so exciting because it, it was like you are in a family that you are able to solve a problem on you or, or together with your friends. Yeah. Class composition in terms of um of the participants. It was very diverse, I must say. We were very many people from, from the Kenyan context. We also had uh, our neighbors, uh, Malawi, Ethiopia, Liberians, and uh, it was a very interactive course in the sense that we all had to share all our experiences from the private sector as well as NGOs and public, yes. The composition, which I probably call a cocktail of, you know, different people of different nationalities with different backgrounds and ex experiences. With this cosmopolitan, you know, sort of uh, uh, situation gave uh, opportunities to look at things differently and how you can, you know, profile solutions to different scenarios in different environments, different geographies and in different countries. If you will allow me to call a word, I will call it super fantabulous. Strat mode is excellent and I think this is the place to be.